हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक टू आर चैनल आज हम क्लास एट जोग्राफी सब्जेक्ट के चैप्टर नंबर थ्री के क्वेश्चन आंसर देखेंगे तो चलिए बिना देरी के वीडियो को शुरू करते हैं फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन मैच द कॉलम एंड कंप्लीट द चेन यहाँ हमें तीन कॉलम दिए गए हैं फर्स्ट कॉलम में टाइप्स ऑफ क्लाउड है सेकेंड कॉलम में एल्टीट्यूड गिवन है थर्ड कॉलम में फीचर्स है हमें इसे मैच करना है और चेन कम्प्लीट करना है फर्स्ट है सीरस इसका आंसर है हाइयर एल्टीट्यूड स्नो फ्लैक क्लाउड्स नेक्स्ट है क्यूमिलोनिम्बस इसका आंसर है वर्टिकल एक्सटेंड इन द स्काई रोरिंग क्लाउड्स नेक्स्ट निम्बो स्ट्रेटस इसका आंसर है लो एल्टीट्यूड कंटिन्यूस रेनफॉल फोर्थ है ऑल्टो क्यूमुलस इसका आंसर है मीडियम एल्टीट्यूड फ्लोटिंग क्लाउड्स सेकेंड क्वेश्चन Choose the correct word from the brackets and complete the sentence. First है the dash of air is depend on the temperature of air. इसका आंसर है vapor holding capacity. Next है the amount of vapor in one cubic meter of air shows the dash. इसका आंसर है absolute humidity. Next, as dash is less in desert area, the air is dry there. इसका आंसर है रिलेटिव ह्यूमिडिटी नेक्स्ट डैश टाइप ऑफ क्लाउड्स आर इंडिकेटर्स ऑफ स्टॉम इसका आंसर है क्यूमिलोनिम्बस इन अ फ्री एनवायरनमेंट, द डैश ऑफ द वेपर प्रेजेंट इन द एटमॉस्फियर टेक्स प्लेस अराउंड डस्ट पार्टिकल्स इसका आंसर है कंडेंसेशन थर्ड क्वेश्चन डिफ्रेंशिएट बिटवीन ह्यूमिडिटी एंड क्लाउड्स फर्स्ट पॉइंट है The amount of water vapor present in the air is called humidity. Clouds, a mass of fine particles of ice and water accumulated around the dust particles in the air at high altitudes is called a cloud. Second point, humidity is in the invisible form. Clouds are in the visible form. Next question. Differentiate between relative humidity and absolute humidity. First point है amount of water vapor present in air expressed as a percentage of the amount needed for saturation at the same temperature is called relative humidity. The amount of water vapor in one cubic meter of air is called the absolute humidity. Second point relative humidity Percentage equal to absolute humidity upon vapor holding capacity. Absolute humidity equal to mass of water vapor upon volume of air. Next question: Differentiate between cumulus cloud and cumulonimbus cloud. First point is the clouds that are found from 500 meter to 6000 meter altitude having comparatively less vertical expanse. are called cumulus clouds the clouds that are found from 500 meter to 6000 meter altitude having comparatively more vertical expanse are called cumulonimbus clouds second point cumulus clouds are gray in color cumulonimbus clouds are dense and dark in color next point they are huge and dome shaped they look like huge mountains next point they are indicators of pleasant weather they are indicators of thunderstorm fourth question answer the following question first hai why is the air in a region dry answer hai due to the low amount of moisture in the air the air in a region is dry next question How is humidity measured? Answer है Absolute humidity is measured with the help of the following formula. Absolute humidity equal to mass of water vapor upon volume of air. The amount of water vapor present in air expressed as a percentage of the amount needed for saturation at the same temperature is called relative humidity. Relative humidity is measured with the help of the formula relative humidity equal to absolute humidity upon vapor holding capacity multiplied by 100 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वॉट आर द प्री रिक्यूजिट फॉर कंडेंसेशन आंसर है द प्री रिक्यूजिट फॉर कंडेंसेशन आर एस फॉलो द टेम्परेचर ऑफ द एयर शुड बी लेस ड्यू टू विच इट्स वेपर होल्डिंग कैपेसिटी रिड्यूसेज वेन द वेपर होल्डिंग कैपेसिटी रिड्यूसेज द रिलेटिव ह्यूमिडिटी ऑफ द एयर बिकम हंड्रेड परसेंट एंड द वेपर स्टार्ट कंडेंसिंग मोर ओवर द टेम्परेचर ऑफ द एयर at this time should be at due point next question what is cloud write its type answer hai a visible mass of fine particles of ice and water accumulated around the dust particles in the air at high altitude is called a cloud the following are the types of clouds first hai high cloud second hai medium cloud थर्ड है लो क्लाउड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन विच टाइप ऑफ क्लाउड गिव रेन आंसर है निम्बो स्ट्रेटस एंड क्यूम्यूलोनिम्बस टाइप्स ऑफ क्लाउड्स गिव रेन नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन ऑन वॉट डज द परसेंटेज ऑफ रिलेटिव ह्यूमिडिटी डिपेंड आंसर है द परसेंटेज ऑफ रिलेटिव ह्यूमिडिटी डिपेंड्स ऑन द एब्सोलेट ह्यूमिडिटी एंड वेपर होल्डिंग कैपेसिटी ऑफ द एयर at a given temperature fifth question give geographical reason clouds float in the sky answer hai the condensed water or fine particles of snow accumulate around dust particles at high altitude leading to formation of clouds the condensed water or fine particles in the clouds are almost wetless therefore clouds float in the sky next question The proportion of relative humidity changes according to altitude. Answer is the temperature is found to be comparatively high in the area at sea level due to high temperature. Moisture holding capacity of air near sea level is found to be high. Therefore, the humidity of the air at sea level is comparatively high. the temperature is found to be comparatively low in the areas at high altitude due to low temperature moisture holding capacity of air at high altitude is found to be low therefore the humidity of the air at high altitude is comparatively low in this way the proportion of relative humidity changes according to the altitude next question air becomes saturated answer hai at certain temperature the moisture holding capacity of air gets fulfilled and it becomes equal to the proportion of the moisture present in it at this stage no more moisture can be absorbed by the air thus air becomes saturated next question cumulus clouds changes into cumulonimbus clouds answer hai cumulus clouds are found between 500 meter to 6000 meter altitude they are mostly formed due to the vertical flow of the air sometimes vertical expanse of the cumulus clouds increases and it leads to the formation of huge mountain like cumulonimbus clouds thus cumulus clouds changes into cumulonimbus clouds sixth question solve the following when the temperature of the air is 30 degree celsius its vapor holding capacity is 30.37 g per cubic meter if absolute humidity is 18 g per cubic meter then what would be the relative humidity given likhenge absolute humidity equal to 18 g per cubic meter vapor holding capacity equal to 30.37 g per cubic meter relative humidity find out karna hai फॉर्मूला लिखेंगे रिलेटिव ह्यूमिडिटी इन परसेंटेज इक्वल टू एब्सोल्यूट ह्यूमिडिटी अपॉन वेपर होल्डिंग कैपेसिटी वैल्यू सब्सटीट्यूट करेंगे 18 अपॉन 30.37 पॉइंट मल्टीप्लाइड बाय 100 इसे कैलकुलेट करेंगे तो हमें आंसर मिलेगा 59.26 परसेंट व्हेन द टेम्परेचर ऑफ द एयर इज थर्टी डिग्री सेल्सियस रिलेटिव ह्यूमिडिटी वुड बी फिफ्टी नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन 
what would be the absolute humidity of air if 1 cubic meter air contains 4.08 grams of water vapor at 0 degree temperature formula likhenge absolute humidity equal to mass of water vapor upon volume of air formula mein value substitute karenge yahan likhenge 4.08 upon 1 equal to 4.08 gram per cubic meter absolute humidity of air is 4.08 gram per cubic meter students yahan hamare chapter 3 ke question answer complete ho gaye hai agar aapko video helpful laga ho to video ko like share subscribe zarur kare milte hain next video mein